name is Stephanie of Zipogeda and I will show you how motion in one dimension works in real life. So let's start. So let's start. This is how motion in one dimension works in real life. That's the question. So first, what is motion in one dimension? It is an object that is moving in a straight line, either forward, backward, up, or down, left, or right, or in another way, the study of the motion of an object is called kinematics. We have some, we have some example here of one-dimensional motion, but we have a race video, so I will show you the race video. So we have here, I will show you the video that I was going to That's the video, okay just watch Okay, just watch the video Okay, that's all the video And now I will, um, let's go to the present So you already watched the first, uh, I mean the race video So now you are going to go to the current slide so you already finished so next we have a climbing a rope so that is an example too a basketball player running back and forth on a basketball court dropping a pencil or people walking down the hallway so this is this is an example of an, a one dimensional motion so that is an example so, distance and displacement. What is the distance and displacement pala? So, distance is the measurement of a quadrant traveled by displacement is related to how far an object traveled from the original location. So, I have here some, I have here one image. So, this is the distance. This is the path taken and this is the displacement. So, displacement is very near that distance. It's very long, right? Okay, speed and velocity. Look at the following image. One shows speed and one shows velocity. What is the difference between these images? So, we are going to answer that right away. So, difference between speed and velocity. So, speed is the time rate in which an object is moving along a path. While velocity is the rate and direction of an object moving. So, this is the and we have here some differences, three differences of them. So first, speed is defined as the distance traveled by a body in given interval time. And velocity is defined as the displacement of the body in a given interval time. So speed is defined as distance and velocity is defined as displacement. So this is very different. So speed, the second difference is it is a scalar quantity for speed and the velocity is vector quantity scalar vector scalar speed vector is velocity and this is the last one is there formula so you already know that or not. so you better study that in the way so uniform acceleration is our last topic so what is uniform acceleration uniform acceleration sometimes discussed as constant acceleration so this is discussed sometimes as constant acceleration it is a special type of acceleration Special. Uniform acceleration is when the speed of an object changes at the same time rate. An example of uniform, uniform acceleration is gravity. So gravity is an example of uniform acceleration. The constant or uniform acceleration of an object due to the gravity is 9.8 meters per second. So this means that an object falling off the building is falling at a constant. Or uniform acceleration of 9.8 meters per second. So thank you for so thank you for watching. Hope you learned something or you understand something. I'm so sorry, I'm so fast. But thank you.